Now, I never thought I would be saying this, but it looks like Zaire Wade is officially back hooping and signed a pro contract and bro is looking super impressive. I've been very critical over the entire time of Zaire Wade's career because honestly, bro has just been average at best for most of the games that we've seen. Now, yes, we know he is the son of Dwayne Wade. And with those comparisons, people are going to be talking crazy and kind of just wondering how good is he going to be compared to his father? And definitely he's not matching up to his father. But with this footage that was just released, I got to be honest and say I'm impressed. Now, clearly here he's playing in this NBA Africa League. And it looks like they got a ton of people on the court here. And Zaire Wade is looking kind of impressive. I mean, his jump shot looks there. He's knocking down his shots. His handles look pretty tight as well. And I think he's definitely getting better and improving a lot because this was a huge step for Zaire. Of course, we all know bro pretty much skipped college, tried to play in the NBA and things were not working out this way. But I think this may be another potential way for Zaire Wade basically to grind work on his game. He just signed this contract is already looking pretty solid here and then work his way to the G League and eventually the NBA. Now, personally, I always say one of the biggest components of about being able to transition well to the next level is just overall your confidence on the floor. Now we saw bro when he was playing in the G League and he was barely averaging any points, probably less than four points per game and playing around 19 or 20 minutes per game, which are just terrible stats and clearly showed you he was just not ready for the regular NBA game. I think this is definitely a step in the right direction and kind of shows you that he's not done with basketball because he still is playing somewhere and probably can have a very successful career in this league and other people like Jonathan Kaminga have also played in this league before which kind of adds to this credibility and definitely it being part of the NBA means it's probably no slouch of course it's not the G League or the NBA but it's still a step forward for him to continue to get better and really just show what he can do as the son of Dwayne Wade. Now, if you do enjoy these types of videos, feel free to like the video and subscribe to the channel. We are on the road to 20,000 subscribers and we are trying to run it up. So join the community and hit that subscribe button now. Now, although Zaire Wade did make this huge announcement, there's one huge problem with this. Just because Zaire Wade has this opportunity to play in this league does not mean he's going to be able to transition to the NBA or even the G League. You guys know when you go higher and higher into these leagues, the competition is even better. And if Zaire Wade, of course, really did not play well, even back when he was in high school and even, of course, in the G League, I think it is just going to make it 10 times harder for him. And he's really going to have to train and focus. And honestly, if I was bro, I would just be training with his father because at this point, he, this is really one of his last opportunities to make it out and try to make it to another league. Of course, to be honest, a lot of the opportunities that he is getting is because his last name is Wade. And I can't hate him for that because at the end of the day, if you have an opportunity to finesse and use your last name to make it into a door, you might as well take it. But I think it's going to take more than just his last name for him to be able to actually stay in some of these leagues. Because you got to prove yourself, man. If you already played bad in the G League, people are looking at your track record and they're not looking at you too nicely. But if he can have a solid game here, play well, he might be able to transition, of course, develop and just take his time to actually get better before he goes back to the G League and eventually the NBA. Personally, I don't think bro is going to reach and be anywhere near how good his father was. But I think he can still have a successful career. But man, bro is going to have to grind for sure. Now, did you know Mikey Williams is actually being black by, by ESPN rankings and the McDonald's All-American list? Well, click this video on the screen because man, they're hating on Mikey and you won't believe the reason why.